Welcome for RTL online trainings. I am here with another entry question. It's very simple, but uh, we may get some confusion. Can we hire an employee in human capital management without a date of birth? Can we hire an employee without date of birth? Is it a mandatory date of birth field in employee page? Actually, it's not mandatory. Without entering the date of birth also, we can go for hire an employee. Let me show you while hiring an employee. We need a human resource specialist role to hire an employee. Okay. So when we go for hire an employee here, we can find first identification details, personal information, employment, compensation, and other, and review. In identification only, we are going to specify. Let's say a hire date is mandatory, obviously. And we are going to specify the legal employer here and if we look at here date of birth is not mandated without date of birth also we can go for hire an employee and obviously whenever we are uh, specifying the project name in the profile they will expect that which legislation this project has implemented. Let's say we have implemented this client uh, for Europe countries. Then what is the social security number? It means national ID, identification ID. For example, if it is India, we have Aadhaar card. If it is US, uh, we have social security number and they will definitely expect the format of that particular national ID. That obviously, because we are working in the project last six months to one year, we must be knowing uh, the identification format as well as the story, as well as the name of the particular identification details that that also they will expect in the interviews. Now I'm going to hire an employee without entering the date of birth. Date of birth I have not entered and I'm going to hire. Let's see whether it's going to be done. If I say it practically so that it will be very clear and if they ask us in the interviews we can confidently explain that yes we can hire an employee without date of birth here but uh, obviously it's required uh, i don't know why oracle has specified that it's optional but whenever we are working in the payroll when you are going to run the payroll it's required to calculate the employee age and the fast formulas uh, how we can calculate the age of the employee system date minus date of birth right based on that we can calculate at the same time how will you find the length of service in fast formulas by using the higher date system date minus higher date so that's how we are going to specify now i'm going to hire an employee here submit Yes, now successfully we are able to hire an employee and the request has been submitted. If there is any approval, we need to check. If not, we can search directly employee. Let's go to our uh, person management page, go to navigator, person management page here, person name. Is, we have not specified the date of birth. We can find the identification details here. If I go to task list here, person information. Go to person information tab here. Now we can find, see that date of birth is not this. So it means it's very clear without date of birth also, we can hire employee in Fusion Cloud Human Capital Management successfully. Okay. So obviously it will allow us to go for update in case if we want to go for update the information, we can update the date of birth. 
let's say January 1st, I'm mentioning 1979, country of the birth, let's say United States, region of the birth, town of the birth, this is all our, our basic things if required. We can go for specific, press OK, and it will be updated. Let's go for uh, submit. So this is how we will be able to perform the things. If at all client says that, for example, I have hired an employee and successfully without date of birth, but I would like to update. I don't want to do it from this page. I don't have the access to this page. How you can do it? We need to go for update the worker by using a HCM data loader. Means uh, technically we are supposed to build a simple HDL file and go for update this worker information, whatever the information is required that we will go for update. Thank you.